It was 25 years ago when I, were, when I was out at um, Utah, Utah State, and I was talking to Vern Bueller, Professor Vern Bueller, and he said, Norman, I'd like to bring Dr. Shingo out to Utah State to keynote one of my conferences. And I looked at Vern and I said, well, maybe I can do it, Vern. <laughs> maybe it's possible, but I want you to see if you could start a Shingo Prize at Utah State University. In Japan, they have the Deming Prize. Deming Prize has been a catalyst to, to pull industry together, to get industry to compete, to be the best in the world. We need that kind of prize in America. And I want you to see if you can get Utah State to set up a Shingo Prize. And then I said, Vern, I also want you to get an honorary doctorate degree for Dr. Shingo. And Vern very nicely said, look, Norman, I can't guarantee anything, but I'll try. A few weeks later, Vern calls me on the phone and he says, Norman, we're going to start the prize. And he said, the university will honor Dr. Shingo with, an, with a doctorate degree. That was wonderful. I then contacted Dr. Shingo in Japan and I told him on his next visit and I gave him a date. We, I want you to come out here to Logan, Utah and to keynote their conference and then a year from now you will receive an honorary doctorate degree from the university. Then I got together with Vern and we planned the process of how the, the um, prize would work and I was able to gather from all the people I knew through Productivity Inc., Productivity Press to establish an amazing board of directors. I remember uh, Gifford Brown at Ford Motor Company and quite a number of outstanding people that joined us on the board of directors to help us get started and to fund us, to give us the money to get started. Well, I compliment Vern and I compliment the university over the last 25 years to be running this wonderful prize. I thank you very much. I hope all of you will go out to this very exciting conference and participate. Thank you. Bye.